95.7 WBUJ, music for the independent mind. Standing there long? No. No, I just got here. I wasn't just standing here. Freshman aren't allowed in the booth. Sorry. I'm Luke, station manager. You must be Becky, the intern? Um, it's uh. Hey, man, what's up? I'm Jesse. I'm Luke, you're late. Hey, I know you. No, you don't. Yeah, I do. He doesn't. Totally know her. Okay, cool. Well, you guys can figure it out while you're stacking CDs. When you're done, there's more. Now, you guys will be spending a lot of downtime together, so please, just no sex on the desk. I've been burned before. I do know you. I sang to you. I remember because you were in a taxi. Wait, is your dad a taxi driver? No. Oh, okay. And here is a sick track by DJ CJ. You like what you're hearing, you Luke's attractive, huh? Excellent bone structure, fancy British accent, really cool tattoos. I think we just met my nemesis. This sucks. I wanted to play music. Not me. I'm here for one reason only. I really love stacking CDs. I was actually offered a job at a lab that tests the effects of marijuana on your appetite, but I was like, no, I want to stack CDs, you know? Like, hopefully in the vicinity of a semen smear desk, because that is definitely what happened here, right? So bad I don't have my black light, then we'd know for sure. So what's your deal? You one of those girls who's all dark and mysterious, and she takes off her glasses and that amazingly scary ear spike, and you realize that, you know, she was beautiful the whole time? I wear glasses. And you're halfway there. You're a weirdo. Yeah, I am, and so are you. It's a good thing we're gonna be best friends and or lovers. Please don't say lovers. You know, I wouldn't pass this up. Once I'm in trouble, I probably won't have any time for you. Wow. No, I didn't think there was a way for you to be less attractive to me. But congratulations, you've managed it. Just wait. You'll go all squiddy, drape yourself all over me. It'll be fun. You'll see. <laughs> 